The skills and knowledge that I gained through the Public Health Nursing Program really changed my perspective and will absolutely change the way that I interact with my patients for the better. I would recommend this program absolutely for the contacts that you're able to make through Johns Hopkins. I mean, the name alone is, is an amazing, it, gets, it opens so many doors for students. The experience that I had here were absolutely invaluable. They changed my, my, my frame of mind, my, the course of my profession and my career. Public health curriculum is so foundational to thinking about um, population level disease or health promotion. How do you even talk about public health? How to present data, um, what really captures a story or what doesn't in terms of an effective public health intervention or not. Something that I think I benefited from more so than people who were just public health students was the opportunity to apply skills through practicums. So I had three different public health nursing practicums and that's where I really got to be in the field in three different settings and learn from current practitioners. I was just in India um, for the Global Health Leadership Project. That was an interdisciplinary program with the School of Medicine, um, the School of Public Health and the School of Nursing. We were able to, the six of us, engage in a research project in Pune, India. We were there for four weeks doing quality improvement and looking at preoperative practices there and whether or not there was over or under testing. And so we went through all the surgical wards with elective procedures. It was a really interesting project for me, especially in something I'd never looked at before. I think one of the things that I learned from Hopkins, especially, is how to lobby, how to talk to my legislators. We have a whole class that teaches us how to write letters to our legislators. Also through this program, I've, got, I've made connections and I've actually done my first lobbying. That for me is really satisfying, and it's, and it's starting small, but eventually those, those small differences, I, I really hope, can spread out and make a big difference one day. Public health nursing sometimes to people is a little bit foreign, like, but wait, if you're not actually, like, I'm not always hands-on with my patients. Um, and sometimes it's not, that's not what they need. And I think that that's an important thing to consider if you want to go into public health nursing, that it may not be the concept of nursing that first comes to mind of being at the bedside and being in a hospital um, and all of those things, that it can take all different forms, um, which I think is an exciting thing about it, that you can be any where doing public health nursing. So in the spirit of lifelong learning, I returned to Hopkins for a post-master's family nurse practitioner certificate. I made the decision to expand my clinical skill set beyond the RN role and beyond a public health nurse role to an advanced care practice nurse because I really wanted clinical work to inform my public health practice and felt that it was important not to lose touch or um, to really be actively engaged in a system as a provider to then eventually be able to influence and inform policy work that I do hope to sort of go back to or at least bridge uh, clinical practice and policy work. I wouldn't have chosen any other program looking back. This is the only program I applied to. This is the only option for me.